Do I get express pass with this or? Uh, no. What is up, Battle Buddies? Tonight, it is a rainy day, but we are here at Universal Studios and Islands of Adventure because the Military Freedom Pass has officially launched for 2024. So you can pick it up at your local ticketing office or even like at your Shades of Green at Disney. But we are here to talk about the perks and benefits you can get for the Freedom Pass compared to like annual pass. What are you gonna get with it? We'll let you know. What is up Battle Buddies? As Brianna just said, so the Freedom Pass is only available to retired military, so that's 20 plus years of service, reservist, active duty, or DOD civilians, of course, and their spouses and dependents. Unfortunately, it's not available to those who only did three years, six years, or even 19 years of service. However, those with disability, you can get the Freedom Pass, you have to be 100% disabled. So sadly, 90%, 50%, that won't work. But Universal does have some good discounts, so. And don't sleep on this. Don't be like him, starting sleepy. So we know what you're thinking. All right, pass holder, well, freedom pass holder. We should be allowed, right? Unfortunately, not. This is a Universal Orlando pass holder lounge specifically for a seasonal pass holder and the three tiers of the universal pass holder. Freedom Pass, unfortunately, does not get this perk. So y'all bear with us because we're dealing with a very rainy night. The only way you can purchase them through Universal is through a vacation package where you have to book the hotel resort package with them along with your Freedom Pass. They can bundle them together. That's what we did last time and it's been a lifesaver. I think the first trip paid for the whole ticket. And we'll put some of the prices of the tickets up here as well. Can you let us know, do we get the uh, discount with this? The annual pass holder discount? I can, I can, see, I can see if we can uh, find a discount. Okay, you, but, uh, yeah. Yeah, we'll see. Uh, okay, no discount. No, no discount, discount on it? Yeah. All right, thank you. We stopped at the shop right across from the Holt. We asked you to take the Freedom Pass discount. He scanned the, the little barcode that's on the Freedom Pass. Unfortunately, we also do not get any discount for food and drink. Next, we'll try merch. <laughs> so we're gonna attempt to buy the Spider-Man little chocolate bar and see if we can get a Freedom Pass holder discount for this. That's why I'm glowing, Ben. <laughs> this jacket's not hard. Hi, how are you? Okay, and I have this. Are we able to get a dis, um, discount with this annual pass? No, it has to be the preferred or premier card. The preferred or pre uh, premier? Okay. So you got gotcha. a blue card or an orange card. Okay. And it's a plastic card like a credit card. Gotcha. Okay, so as you can tell, you also do not get discount on merch here. It is only for the preferred and premier annual passes, which with those, they give you like an actual card. Unfortunately, the Freedom Pass does have lockout dates. It is two weeks throughout the year, one during spring break time frame in Florida, and then another week after Christmas until New Year's. So the 2024 Military Freedom Pass promotional ticket has blockout dates from December 25th, 2023 through January 2nd, 2024, and again, March 25th, 2024 through March 31st, 2024. So in my opinion, I think two weeks out of the year is not that at all, honestly, especially for the price that you're paying. It's a no-brainer. When you compare it to the bottom tier pass, that pass has more, if I'm not mistaken. It has more blockout dates than this Freedom Pass does. And you're paying almost double the price for the basic tier pass compared to the Freedom Pass. Pay more, more blockout dates. Pay less, less blockout dates. Doesn't really teeter totter. And again, this only applies to the Freedom Pass here in Universal Orlando. Hollywood, California does not have anything like this. That's a whole nother ball game, a whole nother story. We can talk about that another day when it's not raining. Do I get express pass with this or? Uh, no. no. Okay, but it's a right now anyway, right? Yeah, so. No express pass, but it's a right now anyway. So, I mean, let's go right to kill some time. So just to break it down with the Freedom Pass holder, what you would get, we'll list them all here. Nothing. 
you do get some discounts on the hotels. Up to 40% off at Cabana Bay and Aventura, which are two of our hotels that we love that we've stayed at so far, plus up to 35% off other Universal Resorts. So when you call to book your stay at a Universal Resort, definitely ask them about the Freedom Pass Holder discount as well as a military discount if they coincide. Just to go back to what Luis said earlier, as the Freedom Pass Holder, the military member can get up to six passes on his name or her name and the spouse as well. So that is a way for the service member to get up to six for their entire family, children, or friends. So that wraps up the video for the Freedom Pass. Honestly, don't sleep on the Freedom Pass. It doesn't offer anything. It doesn't do anything for you, but the price is really low for the amount of park that you get for that pass. We don't have specific merch, but uh, maybe one day, one day. Let us know what you liked about the video, what you didn't like. I apologize for the rain, even though I don't apologize for the rain because it's not my fault. So today's my birthday. I'm gonna go and celebrate the Orlando Former, which just started a minute ago. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you.